Just two years ago, Old Dominion basketball was a disaster. Losing 20 of its 22 games, Coach Blaine Taylor was fired. It appeared it would take years to rebuild the once fine program. And then Dr. Wood Sealing, the school's new aggressive athletic director, hired former Virginia coach Jeff Jones, who would in just 21 months turn everything around big time. I'm Bruce Rader and get this folks, for the first time since becoming a Division I program almost 40 years ago, the Monarchs are ranked in the Associated Press Top 25. ODU's win down in Charlotte yesterday was its ninth win in a row this season and Charlotte is considered one of the top teams in Conference USA. Even more impressive, the Monarchs are 17th in the NCAA's RPI rankings, that's ahead of North Carolina, Texas and Butler. Coach Jones is on the road today, so we checked in with his boss, Dr. Seeling. This being our first time in the history of our program was a little surprising that this is a first, but you always want to make history, you always want to be a part of history, so that is very rewarding, and I think it speaks to the job that Coach Jones is doing, and I think it also tells you that this is just his second year and his staff's second year here, so we are where we are now, and I think the best days are still ahead for ODU basketball. And let me add this. A lot of Old Dominion fans were skeptical when after a national search, Dr. Seelig hired Jeff Jones, who had spent the prior 13 years at American University. Younger coaches like Andy Enfield, now at Southern Cal, seem to be more attractive, but Seelig and President John Broderick, like Coach Jones's no-nonsense maturity, they took a chance, and that chance has paid off. A big day for Old Dominion basketball. The Monarchs play at Marshall on Thursday.